large group of people in a more orderly manner. Alright? So again I said my name is Miss Donna and I'm gonna try really hard to learn your name. We had a head start on some of them that were here last session, so that's good. Alright, so when we get in the pool, we're gonna start with some warm-up songs. This is what I call circle time. And there are a lot of you. This is a new We are completely full and there's two on the waiting list. So if you decide that you really don't like this tonight, let somebody know that you want to drop out because we're going to be okay. Okay? Alright, let's start with a warm-up song. We're gonna sing right around to Rosie, but we do not fall down in the pool. We will jump up. Okay, ready? And remind me again. 
This is Everett. Everett. I love all these names. <laughs> He's like, what's that name? What's that? Hello. Maria. Maria. You gonna hold on? And someday you will, I promise. <laughs> Okay? Sometimes they're bigger. 
life and is designed to do so. And when I bring out the life jacket, I'll show you about the, you know, how you know the difference and that kind of thing. But for right now, we are going to use what we call magic carpets. Ooh, okay. Magic carpets. These are great for laying on their bellies, laying on their backs. Just what if, if they, if they're afraid of it, let them take their toy for a ride on it. Let's just introduce it. Don't, we don't want to upset anybody. We just want to introduce all the IFPs, okay? My youngest daughter hated them all. She would scream bloody murder when I tried to give her a noodle until she figured out she could swim by herself with it. <laughs> then it was all over. It was good. <laughs> so here we go. And then I'll come around and help you if you need help, like how to put them on or that kind of thing. Do you want to go on it? What do I need? Three more, right? And on this, if you let their feet hang over the edge, that's where they can kick, kick, kick. Kick, kick, kick. Kick, kick, kick. All right. Here. My, my buddy will let me hold him. <laughs> All right. So he, he's on the mat. You can either get in front of him, hold their arms. He's still feeling the buoyancy. For kicking something like this, you can also reach down now. I can touch his leg. Kick, 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 kick. Okay. So that they know what kick, 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 kick. <laughs> Good job, buddy. All right, kick, kick, kick to mommy. Kick those feet. <laughs> yes, this is a very common thing. They want to get on it. He wants to be a surfer, dude. That's it. Yeah, I'm a daredevil. He wants to climb. Oh, yeah. 
favorite, you know, you can uh, retry that. So I'll go ahead and gather these up. You like that? We're going to give it? We're going to give it back? No. Can I have your magic carpet? You want to give her magic She'll be gone. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. So now we're going to come back together in our circle. And we're going to sing some songs. Um, remember I said it's really, really important for your children to be comfortable on their bellies. It's even more important that they are comfortable on their backs. Mostly, they do not like their ears in the water. And usually when the ears touch the water, their legs come out. The secret to floating is ears and toes under the water at the same time. Okay? So, as we start early, start in the bathtub, you know, lots and lots. So we have a little song that we use for back floating. You saw a bubble. <laughs> Alright? So, we're going to put your charm on your shoulder just like this. Okay? You're going to walk backwards, so we're going to go clockwise. The other way, turn around. Uh, yeah, come on, Mike. There you go. We're good. It looks like everybody's... Now, turn around. <laughs> walk towards me backwards. Turn around and walk backwards towards me. There we go. There we go. All right. So let's give it a shot. I'm a little pancake on my back. I'm a little pancake nice and flat. I'm a little pancake on my back. Flip me over just like that. Hey, that was really successful. No one is screaming. <laughs> Miss Lila, good job. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do it again. Remember, on your shoulder kind of gives them a real sense of comfort. And you need to dip down really low so that those ears are getting in the water. And hopefully those toes will stay down. <laughs> Ready?
like, oh, this class, you have to dunk your children. When I took my youngest son to swimming, um, they said, oh, you have to dunk your child. That is, we don't do that. You do not have to dunk your child, okay? With that being said, the younger they are, the easier it is to get away. <laughs> okay? Um, so I, the thing I want to tell you about putting your kids under the water when you're swimming is that you need to limit that to like once or twice a swimming session, especially when they're little. You know, don't repeatedly let them be under the water. Um, once or twice a swimming session, and I'm sure you've heard things like blow in their face or, you know, those kinds of things. And that's fine, but it's really more about you being consistent in the way that you do it so that they know it's coming. Okay? Um, so with that all being said, I have a song that we can sing. They don't have to all go under, but there's a song. All right? Um, I usually just put them under because I want to see. You know what I mean? But I know Miss Melody made the parents go under. If you were putting your kid under, you had to go too. <laughs> But I mean, I don't, I don't necessarily say that. And if you, if you want your child, if you want to see how your child would do, um, I will do it for you. I could not dunk my own kid, <laughs> but I can dunk yours. I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I don't have to go home with them, right? <laughs> so if you can't, you know. But like I said, don't worry. If that doesn't happen, have to happen today. You know, it might be down the road. But, but here's the song. With my hands, I splash, splash, splash. With my feet, I kick, kick, kick. With myself, I turn around. One, two, three, we all go down. I will go around and take each one of them and swim with them for the purpose of they do at some point want to leave their kids in swimming lessons and so they need to be able to trust um, an instructor. So I do that at the end of every class. She's a peanut. How old is she? Um, she'll be seven. 
seven months on November Oh my second. gosh, she's really like singing along with the songs and mimicking. She's doing beautiful. Good job, thank you for swimming with me. Can I swim with you? Can I swim with you? Hello. I was just telling the other moms, I take the kids each class because I know that someday you're going to want to let them go with the swim instructor. So, oh, oh, oh. Nobody's being a tough sell for me today. That's a good thing. Sometimes I have them that are like, oh. but I take them anyway. I don't care. <laughs> and her name? Lydia. Lydia. Hi, sweetheart. Look at you. Nobody cares. You're all, they're, all, they're all being so nice to me. <laughs> good job. Let me go get my hard sell over here. Miss Lila, come and swim with Miss Donna. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, sweetheart. Are you gonna Are you gonna pancake with me? She's good at that now. Oh, I'm a little pancake on my back. Good job. Good girl. Oh, put those sweeties in the water. <laughs> Good job, Miss Lila. Oh, she even smiled at me. I have succeeded. <laughs> She's having a good time. Okay. I have succeeded. All right. Oh, Two. Chloe's your sister. Cooper. 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 Oh, think of the car. There you go, Minnie Cooper. Can I see you? Cooper. Oh, can I see you, Minnie? Can you swim with me just a minute? I promise not to take you. Okay. Oh, we got the mommy. Should we get her? Stretch out those arms. Let's get her. One, two, three, two. Good job. All right, Miss Maria. Hi. You're not going to be a tough sell, are you? Hi. All right. Hi, Miss. How old is she? A little over one. Fifteen. All right. Good job. Good job. Will you, you want to pancake with me? Can we pancake? Good job! Good job, big girl! Where's the daddy? Where's daddy? Is that him over there? Yeah. Right, let's get him! Woo. Good job! Good girl! Alright, guys! Do you have to get that close, Bill Mir? <laughs> Anybody really hated it, please cancel it so the, the people on the waiting list can get in. <laughs> okay. Oh, we have siblings coming out there? Yeah. Yeah. Can you give her the ducky? Oh, yeah, I gotta collect my toys. How say did bye I bye, say bye bye, ducky. Thank you, let me get my basket. Good job.